Yo guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, in this video today, we're going to be taking a look at the House of the Dead remake. Now, if anyone can remember House of the Dead from back in the day, classic Sega shooter. Uh, it was definitely one of my favourite arcade shooters that came out alongside that in the Time Crisis series. House of the Dead, absolutely loved it. It was back all way back when in 1997 was the international release in the arcade. This game, believe it or not, never got ported to a console or anything like that. Only, I think it made a PC port a couple of years maybe after the release of the arcade. Uh, and then it, we've no, it's never seen the light of day anywhere else. So great to hear it's coming on the Nintendo Switch. Uh, I have heard a few things about this video, what we're going to take a look at in the trailer. It seems like it's been a little condensed to be uploaded to YouTube. So I'm not sure if the quality isn't that great, but we'll check it out, see what it's all about. Please help. Everyone's getting killed. Oh, the mansion. Oh. Oh wow. Oh these little dudes. Wow. The house of the dead. Interesting uh, the development team there. So, oh, there's a bit more. Switch April 7th. Very good. Just a few little pointers here. Just turn the volume down slightly on that. Oh. Setting quality. Yeah, the quality is really, really. Let's just take a look. The quality is really, really bad. Uh, for the trail of it. I don't know if that's a YouTube thing when it's been up uploaded, but it looks really. I don't know. A little muddy. What's interesting here, what I want, did want to talk about. Um, the movement when they're moving around the screen, this is one thing what I was looking forward to with it being on the Switch. I don't know if they're going to somehow use the Joy-Cons to be able to be used as a shooter, so you get that sort of modern day feel of a shooting game. It is one thing I seriously miss these days with the modern consoles and uh, the TVs, what we have now is no light gun shooters. They used to be a massive part of the arcade back in the past. Uh, PlayStation 2 and 1 had some fantastic shooters on it. The Time Crisis series in particular. In fact, Time Crisis 2 was actually better on the PlayStation 2 than it was the arcade. The graphics were fantastic. Uh, House of the Dead 2 on the Dreamcast. Uh, me and Steve did the playthrough of that. That will be linked in the video cards at the end. Those games uh, were just iconic for me. Even down to like the Point Blank series with a bit of fun with your friends. I do miss the light gun shooters. So I do hope this uses some some way of being able to use the Joy-Con controllers to be able to maneuver the cursor around the screen. You could see the cursor there and, uh, and on the screen when they're shooting. Uh, it does look interesting. I do like uh, the look, what they've gone for. I hope we do get to see a little bit better trailer in a bit more HD quality. It's definitely the way this has been uploaded to YouTube. It, 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 it can't look like that. This game was announced, I think, last year sometime. There was a talks about it, and we haven't seen anything since. It looks like it's pre-order the end of this month and coming out early next month. So things are moving really fast. I have heard that they're going to be doing House of the Dead 2. Now, that may depend, I would say, on how well this does. I do believe it's also getting... Uh, some other console releases and a PC port, but it's got exclusivity to the Switch first. So really looking forward to the House of the Dead remake. We'll definitely be getting involved with this one. Really want to see how the Joy-Cons work. I was hoping we were going to see a little bit of that in the trailer, but hopefully we'll get another trailer release closer to the time. So for more House of the Dead remake, guys, you know what to do. Hit the subscribe button. Hit that notification bell to get notified when all videos go live. And once again, peace, and I'll see you in the next one.